So not long ago I posted a video on how to get your InfraWorks data into Civil 3D using the uh, the tool in Productivity Pack 1 that was recently released for Civil 3D. And that went in and grabbed the uh, terrain information and the roads and uh, some other stuff. But what if you want to get these nifty 3D buildings that can come across with um, with Model Builder? How do you go about doing that? Well that's what I want to show you in uh, in this segment. So what I'm going to do is click the Settings and Utilities icon and then click Export 3D Model. I'll define the region that I want to export and I'm just going to grab these buildings here in this area. And here's the trick, here's the important thing that you need to remember. For the origin, the default is Extent and the defaults are set up to maybe push this model into 3D Studio or, or some product that doesn't really understand or care what a what a large coordinate system is like a state plane coordinate system but we are working in state plane coordinates so we need to accommodate that so to get around that what you do is you pick user defined and you zero everything out and then from there it's just your usual import so if you've ever exported a 3d model from infraworks it's just a matter of choosing where you want to place the file and um, whether you want to break it up into multiple files. I'm only interested in the building, so I'm actually going to do that. I'll check, I'll uncheck ground and I just want the buildings. And I'll choose a location for those buildings. So I'll choose a location for that and uh, I'll just dump this on my desktop, let's say, and we'll call it buildings.fbx. Click export. The software is going to spin for a bit and that fbx file will be created. So next, I need to bring that data into Civil 3D. So here I am in my Civil 3D drawing where I've already imported the, uh, the data from the InfraWorks 360 model, but the buildings are not included because they don't come across with this, um, this command here. So as you saw a minute ago, I exported the FBX file. Now I want to bring that in. So I'll click the Insert tab, click the Import command, and simply browse out to my FBX file. And there's a trick here too. First thing I want to make sure is that I uncheck where it says infer, insert file as block. And then if my units are the same from InfraWorks to here, I want to change this to a number one. So it's one to one. Even though it does say centimeters and feet, we want the correlation here to be one to one. With that in place, I click OK and the buildings drop in right where they're supposed to. So now I can uh, grab some of this information, grab the surface, maybe take a look at it in Object Viewer and see this in 3D. And there you can see the buildings in the context, the 3D buildings in the context of the surface. So that's how you successfully bring FBX from InfraWorks to Civil 3D while getting all the coordinate systems right, specifically um, those 3D buildings that are generated in Model Builder.